Hello everyone. Today I will explain you about the topic that is water pollution. In last lecture I have told you about the environmental pollution, different examples, environmental pollutants. Now I will brief you about the water pollution, its categories, pollutants, water pollutants and the basically the sources of the water pollution. Now first of all you should know the definition of water pollution. So it is very simple, any undesirable change in the physical, chemical or biological characteristics of water which is harmful for living or living organisms including human beings or simply we can say that what is water pollution if water is unfit for use if water is unfit for industrial use agricultural use drinking use then water is polluted or it has some harmful effects on the human health and other life forms now the categories of water pollution we can further classify or categorize water pollution into three different categories first is water pollution may be surface water pollution surface water pollution means if water pollution is related to surface water bodies rivers lakes ponds second category here is underground water pollution so there are so many reasons which are responsible for the underground water pollution and third category in this is marine pollution marine pollution means if we are talking about the pollution that is in sea and ocean so that is the example of marine pollution now you should know the water pollutants how we can classify water pollutants water pollutant means any agent that may be solid liquid or any other impurity that may be colloidal that is a pollutant now we can again classify pollutants into three different categories first is physical pollutants second chemical pollutants and third is biological pollutants so here we have some examples of physical water pollutants temperature if temperature is more than optimum value or not desirable not as per the body metabolism then temperature is also considered as the pollutant turbidity of the water color of the water all these are physical parameters which are undesirable chemical we can again classify chemicals into organic chemicals inorganic chemicals and radioactive elements so radioactive chemicals so different examples are there four organic solvents are there organic pesticides are there for inorganic heavy metals are there toxic metals are there different nitrogenous and phosphorus salts are there in the same way similarly biological pollutants are bacteria for example f coli fecal coliform pseudomonas viruses protozoa all these are biological pollutants and should not be present in drinking water now in this you should know the sources of water pollution what are the sources of water pollution so again we can classify it into different categories so first as per the first classification sources of water pollution hai na so first may be it may be divided into or classified into point sources and non point sources now what are point sources point sources means if the location of the water pollution or the source can be identified can be marked so that is considered as point source of water pollution for example discharge of industrial effluents discharge of sewer lines hai na so these are the examples of point source water pollution second category is non point sources non point sources means where it is not possible to locate easily the source hai na for example if pollutants are scattered on the land area koi land area hai us puri land area pe pollutants kya hai aapki scattered form mein now all these pollutant reaches to underground water table and pollute underground water so that is the example of non point source of water pollution now the next classification as per the next classification source or the sources of water pollution may be 
नेचुरल डोमेस्टिक एग्रीकल्चरल इंडस्ट्रियल माइनिंग एक्टिविटीज एक्सीडेंटल तो हियर वी हैव क्लासिफाइड सोर्सेज इन टू सिक्स डिफरेंट कैटेगरीज नाउ द एग्जाम्पल्स फॉर नेचुरल वी हैव सिलिट सिल्ट सॉरी सिल्ट इरोजन सोइल इरोजन एंड लीचिंग ऑफ रॉक सोल्ट है ना तो ऑल दीज आर द एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ नेचुरल वॉटर पॉल्यूशन विच मेक्स वॉटर पॉल्यूटेड है ना नेक्स्ट इज डोमेस्टिक तो हियर वी हैव एग्जाम्पल सीवेज सोलिड वेस्ट फ्रॉम द म्यूनिसिपैलिटी और हाउस होल्ड सोलिड वेस्ट नेक्स्ट इज एग्रीकल्चरल एग्रीकल्चरल pollutants for the sources includes pesticides and excessive use of fertilizers which are responsible for both underground water table pollution as well as surface body water pollution next is industrial the industrial sources are industrial effluents and toxic metals which are present in industrial effluent next is mining now we know that mining generates large quantity of fine particles and these fine particles during the rainy season makes acid drainage now this acidic drainage pollutes surface water bodies and sometimes underground water table also and last category is the last source is the accidental accidental means due to that is not routinely but some accidentally there is the release of some pollutants for example oil spills transportation of crude oil or petroleum from one country to the other country so there may be the possibility of oil spills so that is responsible for marine pollution in the same way industrial leakage leakage of any liquid material that is responsible for the uh, pollution of aquatic water bodies so this is all about today's lecture thank you